Merry Christmas, America. And Happy New Year. Some tremendous things have been happening. Tremendous things. The economy is doing fantastic. The stock market's at a record high. If only the fake news media reported that. I went to Japan. It was fantastic. I ate sushi from a whale. The delicious. I saw sumo. It was like watching Rosie O'Donnell and Oprah mud wrestling. Only a bit more classy. My hands were huge in Japan. Huge. But some terrible things have been happening too. Terrible things. Like the recent scrutiny. The Hollywood actors and big league journalists have come under for sexual harassment. It used to be women were scared off the dark. Now they're afraid of big name actors and big league journalists. They're not just liars. They're sexual harassers too. They tried to get me with sexual harassment. Talk about the pot call and the kettle black. It's like if Rosie O'Donnell called someone else a fat slob. Every day, another journalist or actor is accused of sexual harassment. Or another Hollywood actress says she was sexually harassed by Harvey Weinstein. In fact, Rosie O'Donnell is the only woman in Hollywood Harvey Weinstein didn't try and sexually harass. But can you blame him? No one in journalism or the media is sexually harassing Rosie O'Donnell either. In fact, she's starting to feel left out. She's a very frustrated woman. She tried to take it out of me. She sent me, well, she wrote a very mean tweet about me when I was condemning sexual harasser Matt Lauer, Matt Lauer, former NBC Today Show's host, another big league journalist, bit the dust for sexual harassment. Matt was a bald man. If only he realized you can impress women in the office with a wig. You don't need to show them your penis. Not that I'm wearing a wig. This ain't fake news. And also, not fake news. Another big time journalist, Charlie Rose, was fired by CBS. CBS News after eight women accused him of sexual misconduct. Seems women love roses, except Charlie Roses. The media have been dumping shit on me since the beginning. But guess what? I keep growing. Now I'm huge. Now I'm dumping shit on the media and big league journalists like Charlie Rose. Let's see if fertilizer helps this rose grow. Roses have thorns. So no surprise, old Charlie Rose's victims said he has a little prick too. 
Now I'm making the dick jokes about the media. Feels fantastic. It's good for women that all these sexual harassment cases are coming forward. Unless we're talking about big time actor Kevin Spacey, in which case he's been sexually harassing men. Hey, maybe that means Rosie O'Donnell has a chance. Except he only molests young attractive guys. Hard luck, Rosie. So I was thinking how much I hate Rosie O'Donnell. You know, of course I had a few hours spare. And I realized if Rosie O'Donnell and I married and joined our last names, she'd be Rosie O'Donnell Trump. Great name. Very classy. Still, no way I'd marry that fat slob. Happy holidays, America. And if any of you are young journalists interning at major news, news corporations or other fake news media, I hope Santa brings you a rape whistle. Merry Christmas.